Hey yo, what is up guys? It is Hell here with Gamertech and as you guys can see, I have the Razer Synthase pulled up and that is because today I will be showing you how you can synchronize the colors from your mouse to the Firefly mouse pad and to the Razer Black Widow. I, I had somebody request this video so I figured I'd make it. So yeah, we'll hop right into this. So basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you on the screen. I'm going to be flipping to a video of my actual mouse pad so I can show you what it looks like. So yeah, so first, um, one thing I like uh, I thought I would mention is you can change the direction. If you guys don't know, like, I'll show you in the video, but you can change the direction that color goes. But right here it says apply to other chroma enabled devices, which you can, so we'll do reactive and we'll make it I don't know we'll, we'll keep it we'll make it blue maybe green green's cool and then um keep it medium and then we'll press apply to others and then it everything will uh react and I I'm going to switch to my camera now so here we are guys with the razor synthase pulled up on my monitor and right here is my mouse mat you can't see right now because i didn't click anything and right here's the black widow keyboard well you can see when we click the mouse it lights both the mouse pad up and the mouse oh whoops i don't want to pull that up but yeah and then what it does is it actually doesn't move to the keyboard but like it reacts like that whenever you press a button it will stay so yeah i'm going to switch back to the razor synthase so i can show you more all right guys so now that i showed you that you you guys can also do any of these any from spectrum cycling to reactive to breathing which i'll show you i'll show you one more but there's there's a lot more cool stuff you can do with the black widow than just what i'm showing with chroma configuration but you actually cannot link that with um you cannot link that with it uh, with your other devices. So you actually the you only you only can um, link them with breathing. Here we'll, I'll show you I'll show you one more. So breathing we'll link that and we will make um, see you have a um, for some reason you have a red and a green setup. Oh red and green. Or we can all yeah we'll just do random color that sounds good and what uh, I guess you can't but um so then all you have to do is press that button there and then it will sync and I'm going to flip cameras just so you guys can see it right now all right guys so as you guys can see I have it pulled up here everything that we said um, and just watch it all links together or synchronizes wait you see it all goes together and you guys can do a ton of cool stuff I'll show you one more I'm gonna flip the camera out one last time all right guys so um I will show you a one more here and um one minute just check in all right um so we will we have to get lighting and you also this is different you guys can mess with this if you ever get this that's pretty self-explanatory but we will do um mm -hmm. i i want to try something out so we'll put on we'll put make it breathe and we'll make it breathe those two but i also want to make it react Oh, here, one minute. I'm gonna delete everything. All right, so we'll make it breathe. Oh, breathe. Huh. I have to press all. Oh, okay, we'll make it breathe the normal, and then we will make it react with it. I want to see if I can link this because I'm not even sure. And we'll make it react in yellow. Yellow sounds good. And we'll press apply. Okay, now let me exit out of here. Oh, you can't. So you cannot make a custom 
configuration and link it. It has to be one of these, which kind of stinks, but I mean, it still gives you a decent bit of, um, I guess, uh, just giving your setup a personality. But yeah, I, I really recommend this. It's pretty easy. You can do a lot of things and link them, but you cannot do everything, which stinks. But um, you can wait. But one, you can link. You can do the same thing with your Black Widow Razor keyboard. Here, I'll show you. We'll make it breathing like it is, and then we will put we'll plus, and we will put a um. What was I doing? Oh, yeah, reactive yellow. And that will work, but basically the only thing that you cannot do is a, you cannot link your Firefly mouse pad. But if you aren't getting that, then don't worry about it. I'm going to switch the camera one last time to show you this. Hey yo, what is up guys? So I'm back in. As you guys can see, we have this hooked up. And whenever we click, oh, right there, so everything's still the same. And whenever you click a button, it goes yellow. But your mouse mat does not go yellow whenever you click a button. But then your keyboard, whenever you click a button, it will react. Alright guys, so as you guys can see, um, we have this here, and it is, this is not, but um, this is synchronized with this, and they, as you guys can see, um, it reacts yellow whenever you click a button. And the same thing with this here, it will react yellow when, um, when you click a button, which you can make the mouse mat breathe here look I'm not gonna switch for this breathing and synchronize with everything else oh darn it I messed it up but yeah you can make this breathe and then you can make it react but you cannot with the Razer Firefly mouse pad synchronize with everything else but with the keyboard and the mouse you can so thank you guys so much for watching the person who requested this video please comment tell me if this video helped you and if you guys have any other re requests for any other video let me know and i will probably do it but thank you guys for watching so much and have a nice day